Greetings, friends! Sonic Toast here! Um, yeah, today I'm gonna be playing a game called Funeral, not to be confused with Space Funeral, though, judging by the page on itch.io, it's gonna be more of a Lisa ripoff than a Space Funeral ripoff. But hey, I think we all know that Lisa's a Space Funeral ripoff, so we're sort of playing a game that's just a ripoff of a ripoff. But it's okay, it's part of a game jam, and it's Portuguese. So I can't fucking read anything on this screen, I'll be honest. Um, I don't think it's finished. Uh, apparently it will get an English translation, but you know, I'll just test it out here and do a little let's play. And I, I, there's no comments on the page. I don't speak Portuguese, but I'm sure the author does. Uh, the author, by the way, is S.R. Lavar, Sir Lavar, on um, itch.io, and that's where you can get this game for free. Let's NASCAR. We'll save. Uh, I did that with, like a French accent. I don't think I'm gonna actually read any of this text because that would just be fucking stupid. You know, I, I know people who sport, speak Portuguese, but yeah, I think this would just be a uh, cruelty to force them to translate all this and like dub it in. Uh, so I don't think I'm going to do that. If any of you guys speak Portuguese, feel free to put this on like 0.19 speed or something and read all this, but I'm not going to read it. So obviously this is the... <laughs> guys, I don't know if you... <laughs> guys, I don't know about you, but this is the Altar de Sacrificio. Obviously I know that says the Altar of Sacrifice. I mean, look, guys, I speak a little Portuguese, but only the words that were westernized or whatever I don't know how history or language works so there's a sprint key but obviously this is the Dark Souls of Lisa we're playing a little Dark Souls night it had a pretty Dark Souls-esque intro I don't know I played one of the games Carne I think he's talking about meat so this is a nasty pile of strange looking organs and another knight's head very Dark Souls-esque Amigo Amigo, don't jump off that cliff. It's no rock. It's just a guy telling you not to jump off it, and you can jump off it. I don't know why. I don't know if this music is original, but... I haven't list, uh, looked into the Lisa music community, but I'm sure this is probably... Either stolen Lisa music... It's probably Terry Hint's joke right here. Uh, but this is probably either stolen Lisa music or original music. I don't want to discredit the guy. I mean... He clearly made all these sprites. I'm not saying they're good, but... Oh, shit. Did I take damage? No. Uh, he did make all these sprites, obviously. They're not... <laughs> I mean, just look at this guy. They're not exactly good. Oh, shit, that was loud. They're not exactly good, but... They are certainly sprites. Did I get something just there? How the fuck do I control RPG? Rolar. Uh... Wait, can I save from the menu? These are the things us Let's Players have to do. We got a strange looking leech creature. It's very Joy Mutant-esque. Oh shit, okay. Wait, can we actually run from this? Okay. Yeah. Well, this beat's not bad. That'll probably increase our... I probably don't need to use that. Oh no, oh no, maybe I do. Oh, is that a Defendo? It sounds like a Canadian martial art. I even actually um, played in the RPG Maker games recently, and I'm pretty sure this is MV. But uh, yeah, I don't recognize that extra health bar. I don't know what that's about. Parisigo, and it's a skull. I can't attack him. Do I have to. Wait, armor. 
What's that? Oh, I do have fighting abilities. I guess. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, and that is a very, uh, a very ugly looking cross and coffin. I'm sorry, that's so damn mean. Good lord, that's so damn cruel. This game is basically if they gamified Hillary Clinton's blood sacrifices. I mean, that's the aesthetic I'm getting from it. And of course, I either miss the save or there's no save. And now I have to do all this again. Oh. Oh, no. I could just access the menu there for a second. I don't know why. I thought they were just gonna skip the intro, but <laughs> I don't think you could even do that in RPG Maker. As in, like, RPG Maker wouldn't be able to detect the fact that I got a game over back there. Oh wait, yeah, we got an item from his hat. I did not equip that, did I? Well, maybe this fun mm, the funny little hammer doesn't look the best. Mm -hmm. And yeah, Final Fantasy optimization doesn't want me to use it. I'm sure this is very useful information for someone who can speak Portuguese. Explaining both the mechanics of the game and how to beat this guy, but unfortunately for me, I can't speak Portuguese. Let's try some armor. Damn, okay, okay. Wonder if that's like a time thing though. Um, his big dick attack. What did that do? I don't know what that did, folks. Folks! I got no idea what that did. Oh no. Does that skull mean he's about to do it? Should I roll? Use my one MP that I just came back? It did! Oh, I'm learning. Now do I have to spam this for five turns? Oh no. That just takes us back a turn in our point accumulation. Accumulation. It's like a Joy Mutant, it's got deadly jaws, but I guess this is more orchestrated? Shit. If it loops like this... Okay. No, we, we have time to... This is just gonna take a while to get our MP back, isn't it? Decivo. Defendendo. Yeah, we're doing Canadian martial arts. This is funny little Dark Souls Knights and Lisa. Now there's a good Lisa sprite if I've ever heard one. Yeah, this looks like it's gonna be the rest of the fight. Hey man, this beat's on point though. Hey man, this beat's on point though. Hey man. I like the beat. I like the beat. Oh hell no! Oh hell no! Oh shit, that takes me down to fucking one? Oh my god. Oh my god, my dumbass forgot to roll instead of defend because I forgot he was charged up. Oh hell no! There's no lo- Oh, I just peeked there. I'm sorry. Fuck. Oh shit. Fuck off. I'm gonna- I really don't want to do this much in the future. I don't like cutting up Let's Plays, but uh, I might have to. So I'll see you guys again when I'm back in that fight. Fuck. Okay, yes, I'm moments. I am moments from kicking this guy's ass. Okay, I just gotta play my cards right and not fuck up. As in, I gotta roll. Okay, yep, time to roll R. Also, the strongest attack, I think, is the one in the bottom left-hand corner. So I'm just gonna use that on this guy. 
But that that's also the attack that takes the most to charge up. So hopefully my monotonous stupidity, stupidity and inability to think while talking, I don't fuck up super bad. And uh, defense spam. I mean, hey, we're both defense spamming here. We're also rule R and... Uh, so I just noticed this guy actually does have a body. I was not paying attention to his sprite until now. But yeah, he actually does have a full-on body and everything. As in, like, he's wearing our, he's wearing our armor. It's a scary-ass Joy Mutant. Shit. Oh. 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 Can I not use this? I don't know why. Am I in a... What do I do? How do I attack? How do I... Guys? Folks? I don't know. I don't know, guys. I, uh... Oh, I was in the roll. I was in the roll still. Okay. Oh, hell no! See that? He's almost dead. And I still have enough to roll. Oh, I guess he was not going to go for that attack. I'm still in the roll. One thing I do notice... One thing I did notice... These sprites, they're rather odd. They remind me a lot of, uh... I don't remember the game. Escape from... New Jersey. It was made by that schizophrenic... druggie. What's his name? I don't know, but people really coddled him. He, he seemed like an alright dude, I guess. Pretty weird. But hey. Did we get blood? What did we get from that? I'll never fucking know. Oh, I think we're getting currency. Oh hell no! Nah. We have not even reached a we have not even reached a save point. Is this, I think the currency is blood. That'd be fitting for this game, the space funeral ass funeral game. Let's get some more blood. Oh hell no! Nah. What? Man, that's some bullshit. Oh, fuck off. Oh, guys, guys, does RPG Maker have safe states? I mean, hey guys, it's the Dark Souls of games. Except in Dark Souls, you respawn right at your fucking checkpoint with all your progress. And in this game, well, you don't. Oh, whoo! This is gonna be a long ride, guys. A long ride for a fucking tech demo. A long ride for a fucking tech demo. Defendo, 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 defendo. That's a standout word I'm seeing here. I sound really fucking stupid and ignorant. Because I don't know shit about this language I'm reading. Like, uh, one thing I do like is the way he falls after jumping out of a gap. I mean, it makes sense. He's got a heavy-ass armor. He's a little knight guy. You know, he's not the most dexterous. So he takes a little smack after he jumps. It's a cool feature because it's not something that well, you'd think of when just looking at Lisa. Like, sure, when you're playing Lisa, you're gonna say, Oh, well, if he falls off a big cliff, he's gotta take big damage. And you're not gonna consider the fact that, Oh, maybe my character should have some weight to him. I could do this cool little neat thing. And it is a cool little neat thing. 
And you know, I appreciate retarded little details like that. But it's a stupid little game. This dumb little game. This dumb little rolling simulator. I mean, hey, they wanted to make Dark Souls but Lisa, so... You gotta have a fuck ton of rolling. I mean, is that really what they're trying to, like... I feel like I get that now. I feel like they're really trying to emulate Dark Souls just down to that degree of... Yeah, you roll a lot. You roll a lot in Dark Souls boss fights, so you roll a bunch in this one too, dude. I mean, I'm not knocking the translation of gameplay, but, you know, whatever, man. It's your prerogative to make me fucking roll everywhere. Is it gonna get old quick? I don't know. I mean, it's an interesting thing so far. Not that this boss fight is very interesting when you have to do it. About three fucking times. And one of them was my fault. One of them was my fault. I won't lie. I did fuck this fight up. Also... Am I fucked for later? Because... I don't have any healing items. And this guy ha is slowly chipping away at my health. Which is very worrying. I want to get at least one more bottom left corner uh, attack on him. And then I could probably just punch him for the rest of his HP. And we'll see. This is becoming rhythmic. Like, I don't think I'm gonna make the same fuck up as before because this is just muscle memory at this point. Muscle memory with the audio cue of the <coughs> the, <coughs> the sound of flesh distorting. His gaping maw. Oh man, if this game gets popular, I'm gonna tell you there's gonna be some mad Vorar to this motherfucker. Some mad fucking Vorar, guys. I want to drop onto this guy's head, but I can't. I can't! I feel like if I jump down that cliff, I'm gonna legitimately die. I also don't remember. I think I interact with that fucking <laughs> mouth on the ground, I guess. That looked more like an, a, a background set piece that it's not... It's like... No! Dude! No, man. No, man. What the fuck? Okay. Um. So the rib cage kills you instantly when you step over it. I was under the impression that it was killing me because I, uh,. Press Z on it, but I, I guess it was because I walked into it. And it's just a game over zone. Uh, okay. You know, I guess they really didn't want me to sneak up on that NPC, so they put a rib cage there. I don't even want to try dropping down the middle because if he doesn't let me out, like that middle gap. Because if he blocks my pathway out as well, then I have to go straight into the rib cage, Which is a permanent insta-kill. Because there's no fucking saves. Yeah. I'm not having a good time with this game, guys. I won't even pretend that I am. I don't even pretend that I know what's going on. I won't even pretend that I know that it's, uh... What's being said. I won't even pretend that I enjoy a Lisa fan game that isn't a Lisa fan game, but is probably using the Lisa source code. Very fucking.
probably. <laughs> Very fucking probably. But, uh, yeah, that, guys, that was Funeral. Maybe I'll make a part two. Maybe I'll uninstall the game from the zip folder that I didn't even bother unpacking it from. Who knows? Uh, but what I do know is that I'll catch you guys next time. Take it easy, and, uh, don't go... Don't go doing anything stupid, guys. Bye. Enough of your sniveling. Shut your fly threat before I shut it for you.